So here's a new uh, 4K quad core processor yeah. from Amlogic. Eight core GPU, don't forget that. Eight core GPU, Mali, Mali 450 GPU. So is this on the market now? Yeah, it's in the market now. So you just launched, right? Last month? Yeah. And um, what is the status? Is this a mass production board or what is this? Yeah, the most um, our most uh, aggressive customer will be shipping by next month. And uh, so this is for a tablet? Yeah, this is for tablet. So you can see this is for the uh, size panel 9.7 inch. And uh, if you want to see this one, this one is for the, you know, 7.85 inches. All right, so this, uh, those are reference PCBs? Yeah, this is a PCB, you know, give you ID. Design kind of? Yeah, kind. All right, and, uh, and you also have a set-up box. Yeah, we also have the, you know, set-up box reference board. Also with you know, M Logic, M8. Can you show the ports around? Yeah, so, sure. So there's a 4K video and 4K Android signal that can go out of the HDMI. Right here, the 4K video will come out right here. 4K 30 frames per second. Yeah. And it looks just awesome. So here we can see uh, this 4K support basically. Uh, you go from uh, 1080 all the way up to 4K. And this is 4K UI. It's rendering a 4K UI. Uh, yeah, it's so clear you can compare it to you know 1080p TV already there. Yeah. With Android 4.3. Uh, so it's a 4K Android support, basically. Yeah. That's cool. So, uh, let's walk around. All right. What are you showing here? Uh, <laughs> yeah. We are showing our existing dual-core solution. We are showing our, you know, smart monitor, touch panel, you know, smart monitor. All in one PC kind of style. Yeah. yeah. Is this a uh, capacity 23 inch or how big? 22, I guess. 22? 20, yeah, 22. It's a good price, right? Compared to Intel and all that stuff. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, but AOC is also, you know, very good brand in yeah. market. And, so, you know, this for the, you know, the tablets with, you know, D, yeah. with, uh, you know, DTV building. So you can watch T TV on it, yeah. like, uh, you know, in the next year, 2014, the World Cup. You know, in the South America. All right. And this is our, you know, Qualcomm solution tablets right here. So this is our, you know, using M802. So uh, as a result, right here. So yeah. that means it's pretty high. Yeah. Uh, is it higher than all the other chips? Yeah, it's higher. How high is it compared to 3188? 31. Rock chip. Uh, Five or six thousand, and you know, we just launched our chipset last month, so we're still doing, you know, a lot the, of tweaking, right? Yeah, tweaking works. So, yeah, yeah, our best score on the N224 is like 25,000, so yeah. which is a lot higher than them. All right, uh, it's not, it's not yet, uh, I mean, it's not yet uh, big little Cortex A15. Uh, stuff like that. You haven't announced that, right? At Amlogic yet. You're just announcing this one, the quad core. Yeah. All right. Uh, and uh, what is over there? Can we check it out? Oh, uh, you want? Oh, this yeah. is doing. You know, this is this two is using uh, 802. So it supports. You know, this this is a retina panel. So the resolution will be the 2560 times. You know, 1600. Can we turn and, on? Yeah. Okay, let me and here also quad core in here. Yeah, this is quad core, but this is you know 801. 801. Yeah. So you use 802 for retina. Yeah. 802 you for. You cannot do 801 for retina. One no. One is optimized for one, one is the other. Uh, 801 and 802. The main difference is 4K, not 4K. And what else is different? You know, two channel DDR3. And the other one is only. Only 802 can do retina. Uh, dual channel DDR3 is in 802, and 801 doesn't have it. Yeah. The 801 is what? 30, 32 bit. 32 bit single channel yeah. DDR3. Yep. 
and the other one is dual channel 64 bit DDR3. Yeah. Uh, 1GB, 2GB, what's the standard configuration going to be? 1GB. RAM. RAM. Um, 2 gig, 2 gigabyte. All these have 2 gigabyte? Uh, I believe these two are 2 gigabyte, and this one could be the 1 gigabyte. I didn't really say them through. So, quad core, quad core? Yeah, quad core, quad core. And uh, which companies are making these? Is it uh, this reference or? They're right here. You're like no, this is actually this is from us. We just have you know, our ODMs help us to build this. Okay. Also, similar? Yeah. This is also a quad core solution. But you're not having a quad core in here, do you? Uh, no, this is a quad core. So, you have a quad core laptop? And Android notebook. 13.3 inch? Yeah. And uh, I can go here with the mouse. I can go here and I can see that it's Android 4.3, yeah. 802. You can even go here and change it to English. Oh, you know Chinese, right? Yeah, <laughs> and uh, so this, this looks awesome. Yeah. Uh, this is a Ultrabook killer. So it's, uh, how about Chrome OS? Chrome OS? Yeah. You have it? No, no. No? Are not you yet. testing? Yeah, I think our engineering side is working on that. Maybe? Yeah. That would be awesome, right? Yeah. Uh, battery life is probably good. Yeah. It's a big battery in here. Maybe. So is this only uh, like a reference, this one? Or somebody might be making it soon? I think some, someone is making this one, right? Somebody is making this already. This is this yeah, yeah. yeah sure. company. Is it here? Is it this one? Yeah, this one. This one. Okay, so. Oh, focus. Okay, NB3C. Uh, GPS Technology Shenzhen Company Limited. Uh, 28 nanometer chip. So basically, this is 28 nanometer. Yeah. High K metal gate. TSMC. Yeah. TSMC 28 nanometer. Yeah. Well, oh, it's not HKM. Metal gate, then it's uh, something else or HRP. What do you call it? HRP, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. but uh, and uh, what is the frequency of the GPU? Is that frequency around six? <laughs> 600? Yes, yeah, sir. All right, uh, are you planning to have other software on the laptop support something else only Android or is it possible to have Linux, Ubuntu? Uh, yeah, we, we might have the Linux on our, you know, um, platform, but we are, uh, we really are, uh, currently we really are Android-based company. Okay. Yeah, but uh, you know, we are, but we, we are working on the Linux. Cool. And here, what's in here? Oh, this is for, you know, this is, this tablet have the you know, Adobe DS1 built in, so. This is a dual core? Can yeah, this is dual core. Yeah. DS1 is something you can have on the quad core too. Yeah. Yeah. All right. We have the full license about this. What do you show here? Just some, you know, low end solution, you know, super thin. Which CPU is in, inside? Two core MX. Dual yeah. Core? MX L. All right. All right. So. Uh, have, uh, I'm, I'm Logic announced how many processors are shipped every year, or has that been announced? Uh, monthly is not announced. All right, but uh, no. Okay. Cool. All right, cool. So that's awesome. 4K. Thanks a lot for doing 4K. Yeah, thank you. How about recording? Is it 4K recording or no? Camera? No. no. Okay. Not possible, right? No. Okay. Cool. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah, we're working on.